Good morning, friends. It's Mrs. Virial with your morning announcement. Today is Friday, May 27th, 2022. Today is an A day for everybody. A day for first grade, second grade, and kindergarten. Our lunch choices today include cheese or pepperoni pizza, peanut butter and jelly fun lunch, or the popcorn chicken salad. And we have apple slices for snack. I don't have any lunches to announce for Monday because we are not in school on Monday because of Memorial Day. I do have several birthdays to announce. One, I totally forgot Mrs. Heron's birthday earlier this week, and I apologize, Mrs. Heron. Happy birthday to you. Today, Miss Logan Gazat, our uh, kindergarten teacher, is celebrating her birthday. It's a special one. She's turning 30. Some of us remember 30, and some of us look forward to 30. So happy birthday. We have several birthdays this weekend. On May 28th, Harrison Martin in kindergarten will be having a birthday. On May 29th, Olivia Hanawald in second grade will be enjoying a birthday. And on May 30th, Charlie Taylor will enjoy a birthday. It's a very popular weekend for birthdays. All right, some special announcements or daily announcements. Mrs. Shrewsbury is out again today. We're looking for a sub for her. I will definitely fill in for her My Time group, so you can send your friends down um, for that. Um, we'll we're hopefully can find somebody to help us with recess because that's the big deal. And of course, I have 100 meetings. I'm working on getting a bus for a backup still um, for today's walk to the high school. You probably see me holding my poppies, just some of the many poppies that were donated by the American Legion Auxiliary to us. Um, I'm very excited to share these with everyone today so that you can take them home. Um, remember to wear them on Monday. You can wear them all weekend if you'd like, but remember to wear them on Monday and, and think of your veterans because we wear red poppies on Memorial Day, uh, which is the last Monday in May, always to commemorate the sacrifice that so many men and women who gave their lives fighting for our country. So this is just a simple reminder and a simple way for us to say, um, we remember you and we appreciate everything you've done um, to help us. Uh, Mrs. Huber, who helped us get all of the uh, poppies in our building, also shared this book with me called Lest We Forget. This is an amazing book put together by Mrs. Mary Blossom, who was a former teacher here in Manchester. And she um, collected all of the um, service members from Manchester from about 1915 to uh, 1999 on service members who had um, passed away either in the, in the line of duty or as active service members. And she has the collection in here. The first service member that's listed, his name is Emil Jacobs. And if you know, um, the American Legion is named after him. He was the first service member um, from Manchester that had passed away in the line of service. So there is um, lots of really interesting pieces in here. Lots of interesting history um, about our service members, uh, just beautiful pictures of them um, as they went through their life. This book unfortunately ends with um, someone uh, your staff might know is uh, Miss uh, Jill Renee Larock, who was a um, student here in Manchester for a bit, but her um, stepmother uh, was our teacher, Sue Larock, um, Sue the Roke. I'm sorry, I say those wrong. I apologize. Um, and uh, Jill is mentioned in here as well. So she's the youngest or the, the most recent. Um, person who had passed away in the line of uh, uh, service since 1999. Now, I know this book needs to be updated and there's just, it's just filled with some really interesting information. So I'm excited to share that with anyone who wants to look at it today. All right. Uh, our fun day sales today include flashlights, Play-Doh, two kinds of bubbles, keychains, and poppet bracelets. I will be around, um, I think around nine o'clock today. Got lots of meetings, so I'm going to figure those out uh, with those sales, and I'll be outside after school. Remember, we need to be at the performance in the junior senior high school by 1.15 to start, so we need to be there a few minutes before that. Um, I think those are all my big announcements, so it's time for me to say now look to your teachers and decide how and when you'll do the Pledge of Allegiance. And remember, have a super swell day at Playgirl Elementary, where we are super leaders and super readers. Have a great day.